Cabeta Call Harry investigation shut down two illegal towing companies. One of them tried to charge a customer eight thousand dollars for a tow. So, okay, Harry, who should we call if we do need that tow? First of all, it was a crazy story, and the, the fact that that Georgia State Patrol and their compliance division shut them down is a great thing. But a lot of us don't think about who to call because we don't think about breaking down, and it really depends on the situation. Did you break down or was it an accident? If you're in an accident, confusion could cost you a lot. That's what happened to our accident victim. An illegal towing company responded after hearing her location on a scanner. And even though the trooper warned her and the other drivers that the wrecker wasn't on their state approved list, she used them and got a bill for $7,895. I've heard many people say, why not call AAA? You get free towing with your membership. I've been a member for years, but Georgia State Patrol says not when you're in a crash. I mean, and I realize people pay a lot to have AAA, but that's who you want to go to if you need a tire changed or your transmission blew up. You have some mechanical defect. If you were in a crash, you really want the quickest person to get you off that interstate because you really don't want to stand on the side of the connector for three hours waiting on AAA to get there. We are not saying AAA is always slow, but if you crash and you're hurt, law enforcement is going to call one of its approved wreckers. Here's the list. These companies go through background checks and have limits on how much they can charge you. If you crash and you aren't hurt, you can ask law enforcement to call one of these guys or you can call your insurance company and ask. There are plenty of legitimate wreckers who are not on the list, but have all the credentials. Mike Sutton with All Star Towing says, a legitimate wrecker will give you the pricing up front. When you break down, you are in a crisis position that you need help. So a lot of times you don't think. No, you don't think. No, you can't think, you're confused. You know, what am I do? Who do I call? Well. All right, so here's the takeaway. If you don't know what to do, ask law enforcement on the accident scene or where you're broken down to call someone on their list. If your insurance company won't answer the phone and you've got someone you want to use, get the price up front. It should be in the neighborhood of $125 for a hookup fee, and then the average is $3 a mile. I'm Better Call Harry, Atlanta News First.